I'm Casual TTV and I'm back with another video. And if you're new here, welcome. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button if you like what you see. And turn on your post notifications so that you will be notified every and each time I upload. Because if you don't turn that on, you might only see videos I did six months ago. So do not forget to hit the notification button. And if you do like what you see, do not forget to give it a like and comment down below what you want to see next or what you think of this video. So what I have here is a brush and we're going to do brush versus sponge. Now this um, brush is by Sonya K. I got this at Target for about $10 and this sponge here, I got it from... Um, Ulta, it's Mo Morphe collabed with um, Jeffree Star. So he came out with his own sponges. It came with three this size and then two small ones. Now, um, a brush will help you get full application, full coverage. It doesn't eat your makeup as much as what's um, in competition. So with the sponge now, you gotta make sure it's a soft one or else your skin will get irritated. Um, the sponge, I mean the, the with the brush, you will um, put it on the back of your hand. Either way, whether you're doing a sponge or whether you're doing a brush, it's better to put the foundation straight to the back of your hand or if you have something to put the foundation on to, to transfer it. I don't recommend putting the foundation straight on here because as soon as you put it straight on here, it pushes down and that's how you waste product so it's better to put it on the back of your hand take your finger and move it all around and then blend it out now with the sponge what a sponge does is it gives you moisture because it is damp do not forget to wet your your sponges wet your sponge okay so the sponge now the sponge same thing do it on the back of your hand save your product but what the sponge does, it does absorb your foundation. So you will end up using more foundation, but not as much as going to go onto your face. So make sure you get that in order. Uh, put it on the back of your hand and then move it around. So now with the sponge giving you moisture, you will not get full coverage um, right away. You have to build it up because of the moisture and it absorbing your makeup. So it's possible that you can get full coverage with a brush right away and the sponge, you have to build it up. Now, I use them depending on my mood, you know, if I want to look like I'm about to do a photo shoot or not, you know, it depends on the mood. Depends on my sponges also being clean or not. So let me just get into the demonstration because that's it what is springtime. So what I decided to do was I went to Target and I picked up this Fit Me um dewy smooth and it is for normal to dry skin and maybelline and i got the shade 330 toffee okay yep it's been a while so this bottle i miss i actually miss having a squeeze now that it's like this all right whatever so i'm gonna put this on the back of my hand and i'm gonna pray this is my shade because when it's drugstore, you can't do swatches. You just gotta hope for the best. So I put this much on the back of my hand just now. That looks like a good match though. My fingers dab into it. And I'm gonna put it all over my face. And let's blend. So now that I did um, just this side, I am going to do the other side. Okay, so this is how the sponge looks so far. Now I could probably go in with another layer. You know what? Definitely darker than my neck, but don't watch that. And I'm not gonna bring it down because I'm not about to ruin my shirt.
So now I am going to do the other side and I'm going to do the same thing. Oh crap. And I am going to start buffing with my brush. I'm going to come in closer so you guys can get a better look and we're going to compare side by side. Now the first side was done with the sponge and I put on two layers. And this next side is the brush which I only did one. So, let me know down in the comments which do you use or if you use both which one do you use the most. And let me know if you are using your sponge dry because some people out there using that sponge dry and that's not how you do it so since you watched this video you educated yourself a little bit more um and turn on your post notifications and i will see you guys in my next video